the finance sector has a primal role in addressing climate change in a timely fashion. We need to refresh our memories of the commitments that we have made already to stabilize the climate, to protect the natural world, to stem pollution. And thereafter, we need to make very real and meaningful actions to meet the goals that we have agreed. Such meaningful action also means shifting gear in the finance sector. There's so much at stake here. We have burnt fossil fuels, adding something like 280 billion tons of carbon into the atmosphere, causing the 1.2 degrees Celsius warming so far, and all the dramatic impacts from droughts and floods and strengthened hurricanes and forest fires we're seeing in the world today. We need all hands on deck to mobilize all the financing that's necessary to get back on track. I encourage banks, insurers, and investors to show the leadership in this space. This is as much about opportunity as it is about managing risk. And um, the opportunities that uh, are created are quite significant. There is not enough finance going in the green direction. If we look at how much is financed in green investment, last year it was only 100 billion. So we are short of two thirds of what is absolutely needed. We must not lose focus on the fight against climate change. If you don't like the pandemic, you will not like the climate crisis one bit. But in a world of uncertainty, what we know is that the role of responsible finance, the sharpening of the ESG agenda to deliver real world impacts, and the alignment of portfolios with international frameworks to protect people and planet are more critical than ever.